We are doing a quick walkthrough on our Chautauqua build. Showing you guys through the house. We got blue tape that we've worked the whole house with. When do you do it? When you actually go forward and blue tape the house? Right when you're fully staged and you have furniture everywhere. Truthfully, this should have been done beforehand. It's okay, it's not the worst thing in the world. Uh, we got staging in, which is awesome. This looks weird. I don't love that. A lot of the rooms are done. The closets look amazing. Really happy with how they, they came out. We'll get the LEDs finished up. Okay, so we are currently in the primary bedroom of our house here in Chautauqua. This is in Pacific Palisades. And this bathroom just looks absolutely amazing. Genuinely loving the double fixtures. I'm loving the double sinks. I love the pink on this vanity. It's coming out amazing. And the details just really shine through. The staging is coming together fantastically. And um, I really can't wait to show you guys all the pictures and videos that come out of this house. But this shower is really the, the winning thing. This, the way the pink on the stone is coming out on these two shelves and the whole bench for me, that's the piece de resistance. But check out these closets. Really fond of the white oak closets. We're doing them right now. Not so much, but we're doing them a little bit more. This fireplace with the radius design really fun it's an electric fireplace it's not a gas fireplace so something that should be noted but it's coming out looking great let me know what you think about the rest of the house let me take you through a little tour really quickly <laughs> so we're currently hanging out in the basement now what you're gonna see when you come down those stairs is kind of like a little just bar lounge section area how we envision it it's up to you but we've kind of placed it with a table and some chairs and really just making it more of a relaxing place for the owners to kind of come down and feel secluded from the rest of the world right so we put in this nice bar. I'm currently sitting in the movie theater. Beautiful, beautiful spot to hang out in. I really like it because it's really quiet. Really quiet. I feel away from everything right now, uh, which I really, really love. The next thing you're gonna see is our utility room, our gym, two bedrooms, a laundry room, and of course, you guessed it, there is an elevator in this house. We also have the laundry room upstairs as well on the third floor, uh, which I'll show you right now. One of the cool things about this house is the elevator system. You know, a lot of people really like that knowing that they have an elevator, but truthfully never really use it. It's just not convenient. When you're thinking about the time it takes to call the elevator and go up there and use it, you could just take in the stairs and been done. But it is a cool feature and it actually is really helpful when you're planning parties or using the rooftop for events, things like that. So taking everything up and down is not such a big deal. Pretty convenient for that factor. 
If you have any questions about any of this stuff, please go ahead, leave the comments down below and I will get to them. I may not be fast at responding, but I do respond to every single comment. I promise you that. So we are now here on the rooftop deck of our Chautauqua project. And first of all, it's just absolutely beautiful. The, the fresh air up here is amazing. So we're doing all this uh, touch up. We're doing blue tape walkthrough right now on the house, which means there really isn't much to see on the first floor. But that's where they're working really hard. But I wanted to show you the rooftop deck because it just is absolutely phenomenal. The views are incredible. Let me know what you think. So you got the door up from the stairs. You got the door out from the elevator. So he's got this really great lounge space here with views all around. Got mountain views over there. And then you got water views on this side. Now, today happens to be a pretty cloudy day. So it's kind of hard to see, but all along this whole entire horizon is water and it just looks amazing. This is probably my favorite side to be looking at. It just looks incredible. Another cool thing that we did here on this rooftop is that we added a water hose, a drain, and a gas line. That's that way when you buy, you can buy a barbecue, put up a sink up here, and kind of prep this house to be useful up here. I think it would be great. You have like a little mini kitchen. Anyway, that's the rooftop deck. Outside of this house, we have probably some of my favorite features. Um, we're doing pavers, which is just fantastic. These are permeable pavers, which basically just means that when water is going on them, they are not rolling on the surface. They are actually dripping through the gaps in the pavers to allow water to drain through them. But this outdoor space is fantastic. It is totally catching the vibe from the inside to the outside, which is really our goal, really making sure that uh, when you're leaving the inside, you're coming out to the outside, you don't feel like you're going to a completely different space. You are being welcomed into the same home, to the same space, and having that same exact experience. We have an amazing barbecue. We've got plenty of space to play in the side yard. Um, plenty of couch space, dining space, which are all really important things when we're talking about the exterior design. But one of my favorite things about this house is actually the pool in the pool tile. That green tile, just for some reason, it is totally speaking to me. It looks amazing and it really matches the interior fireplace in the family room. I don't know if you noticed that, but I think it just looks fantastic. And of course it has the automated cover that we're putting on all of our houses. So I really think that this backyard is just incredible. And I'd really love to know what you guys think about it, of course. So please let me know in the comments down below what's missing. What would you like to see in these backyards? Uh, how can I do it any better? Or maybe let me know what your dream list items look like. I'd love to hear from you. Another thing to note, is the 24 gallon port of carpets that we put into the backyard for extra privacy. A lot of neighbors get really upset with us. They think that, you know, we're just completely demoing the houses and making it super easy for everyone to see inside their houses when we put up to two stories in front of the single stories. But the truth is no, when we build these houses, we want the owners who buy these houses to have just the same amount of privacy that our neighbors feel. So it's really important to us to add these trees into get the privacy that these houses deserve. So if you're ever one of those neighbors who are thinking the builder next door is just trying to profit, no, we really are building a quality product that we can be proud of. This has been my tour of our Pacific Palisades home. Uh, this is our Chautauqua project. Uh, it was a fantastic project to get to be a part of, to watch the build. Um, I really hope that I really hope you guys like these videos and are seeing the designs and the aesthetics that we're putting into them. I know you also like the construction content and we do that on other projects. This one, we didn't really get that much construction content on, but not to worry, there are more projects to come. And uh, if you wanna see more content just like this, please go ahead, subscribe to the channel and I'll see you on the next video. Hey, it's Jason again. I don't wanna talk your ear off too much, but if you wanna see the rest of the tour, Go ahead, watch a few more minutes of it. I'll just put it in the B-roll so you can see what the rest of the house looks like.